Block and rehearsal up. Ready and action. My name is Rachel Hemsley. I'm a writer, director, and actress. And I'm going to give you guys some filmmaking tips on how to direct and act in your own movies. There are so many things that I wish people would tell you about directing and acting. I mean, first of all, every director is different. Every director has to figure out what is gonna work for them when you're directing and acting at the same time. So these are just some of the tips that I know that I figured out as I go. Scene three, Azerbaijan, take one. The biggest thing is preparation. So storyboarding, doing pre-visualizations, tons of rehearsals, tons of rehearsals, really making sure that everyone is on the same page so that when you're in front of the camera or you're doing your thing, that you can just be in actor land and everything else is taken care of. It's gonna make everything go so much smoother. Great, and cut. Perfect, guys. So good. I'd also recommend having an amazing team behind you. That's really so essential. You gotta have an amazing director of photography who is just on the same page as you. So while you're in front of the camera or while you're occupied doing a million other different things, they know exactly what you're going for. It really saves a lot of time and you can put a lot of trust in that person. Same with you know having a great script supervisor, having amazing producers who are on the same page creatively, who can be you know giving you tips and be an extra set of eyes when you're, again, in front of camera. Also having a stand-in, that is like the number one thing that has saved my life. Having a stand-in that kind of looks like you, is the same height, build, really helps that you can be behind the camera, see the shot, work with your DP, even do rehearsal so you know exactly what it's gonna look like, and then you can switch out with them at the last minute, it's super helpful. Also practice, practice, practice. Take your phone, take like whatever camera you have, just go out and shoot stuff. Practice actually setting up stuff, directing, and putting yourself in front of the camera. You can practice changing the direction you wanna give yourself, thinking about how to go back and get things again, kind of in the same vein. Put time in for yourself. When you're just an actor, you have all this time of preparation, you go into character, and then on set, you just get to focus on your performance and, and what you're gonna be doing. When you're also directing, you're taking care of every other department as well as acting, so really making sure that you put in the time beforehand to get to know your character, really be able to jump in and out of the headspace really quick so that you can go from director mode right into acting mode and really be in one or the other. It's easy to get distracted, but uh, just really taking time for yourself with takes too. If you need another take, you take another take. Don't worry if you feel like, oh, self-conscious, like I'm also the director. Do what you need to do to get the footage you need, to get the performance you need. Don't ignore yourself is, is the biggest thing. Oh, Directing in a corset. Wouldn't recommend. Well, there you have it. That's all the filmmaking tips that I have for now. So just go out and try making stuff, make mistakes, do your thing, and have an awesome time doing it. I'm Rachel Hemsley, and this has been Filmmaking Tips for Directing and Acting in Your Own Movies.